Arms candle volume charts are created by placing a candlestick inside an equi volume box. The equi volume box dictates the width based on relative volume. Let's look at each of these individually and then show the merged product. An equi volume box consists of three components, price high, price low and volume. The price high forms the upper boundary. The price low forms the lower boundary and volume dictates the width. Equi volume boxes are black when the close is above the prior close and red when the close is below the prior close. When calculating equi volume charts, note that volume is normalized to show it as a percentage of the lookback period. For a 4-month daily chart, each day's volume would be divided by total volume for that 4-month period. As such, the width of each arm's candle volume box represents the percentage of total volume for the lookback period. High volume days take up more space on the x-axis, horizontal, than low volume days. With varying width, this means the date axis will not be uniform. Some weeks will extend longer because of high volume, while other weeks will be shorter because of low volume. This chart shows IPG with arms candle volume over a 4-month period. Notice how October extends more than the other months because the arms candle volume boxes are quite wide during this month. This chart shows IPG with normal candlesticks for reference. Candlestick Overview Traditional candlesticks capture the high-low range as well as the price movement from open to close. Using Colored Candlesticks there are basically four variations and these are shown in the intuitive surgical example. First, the price change from the close to the prior close determines candlestick color. Candlesticks are black when the close is higher and red when the close is lower. Second, the price movement from open to close determines whether a candlestick is hollow or filled. The candlestick is hollow when the close is above the open, and filled, solid, when the close is below the open. Third, the upper and lower shadows, the thin lines above and below the body, capture the high-low range and match the height of the arm's candle volume box. Arm's candle volume. The next three charts show how equi volume boxes and candlesticks merge to create arm's candle volume charts. Equi volume boxes, candlestick, arms candle volume charts, interpretation. Chartists can use arms candle volume charts to find candlestick reversal patterns and analyze volume flows to complement these patterns. The example shows Costco, cost, with a high volume bullish engulfing pattern on October 9th. Not only is this candlestick long, but it is also wide because volume surged to its highest level in over two months. Arms candle volume captures this volume surge with the widest box on the chart. Volume validates the bullish engulfing pattern and affirms support from the late August low. Notice how the stock continued higher the next three days as buying pressure remained. It is also worth noting two other features on this chart. First, cost broke out with a gap and wide arms candle volume box on September 5th. Second, a bearish engulfing on high volume marked the mid-September peak and the stock broke support with a close on the low. Note, however, that the true width of arms candle volume boxes is shown when the chart ends on that particular date. For example, cost broke out with a gap and wide arms candle volume box on September 5th. The width of this box is not finalized until after the market closes on September 5th.